Well, March for Babies wants to prevent premature births, birth defects, and infant deaths. Haiti Clatter shows us how families in Bemidji are taking a walk to remember their loved ones. The loss of a child is one of the most painful experiences for a parent. Desiree Pox Leitner knows that pain too well. At 22 weeks pregnant, she lost her son Caden to a genetic disorder. Talking about it with others, it helps heal and you just kind of feel like you're with him when you're talking about it. And um, even just planning this event with a committee and being together with other moms that can relate has been really helpful for me. The Pox Leitners were the chosen ambassador family for the 2017 Bemidji Area March for Babies. Desiree walks to honor Caden. You know, we can't do fun things for him like birthdays and such and celebrate his life. So instead we just celebrate his memory and every year we, you know, we find special ways to do so. and. He'll always be with us. March for Babies is for anyone who's dealt with premature birth or infant loss. The march started at Bemidji State University's rec center and superheroes led the way. It's just amazing to see this turnout today. But these aren't your average superheroes. Some of these kids were born prematurely and used their very own superpowers to defy the odds. So to do the superhero sprint was to cheer them on and to cheer on their families for overcoming scary situations. A memory garden let families plan a memory for their loved ones. The march is a place for families to also remember who they lost, have hope for the future, and celebrate. That is another reason that we walk, to celebrate the obstacles that they've overcome and that their families have overcome. Lydia Petruszewski can also celebrate with her daughter, better known as Feisty Faye, who was born prematurely but is now a thriving four-year-old. She says these walks will continue until all babies survive. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.